face. Anyways, third segment time, the comment. Single comment? What do you, what? Just one? Wait, we have one? Uh, You're telling me, on me, that the entire time that I've been gone from this channel, it has, like, grown at all. No, we have we've comment. had more comments since you've been gone. We just get, uh, we, we read the comments every week, and we get, like, about one a week. Wait, 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 hold up. Will, take a guess how many subs he has. I want to guess uh, how long you've been gone. What? Take a guess at how many subs he has. Two hundred. What? Two hundred. Two hundred. We're at five hundred and nine. Oh really? Yeah. Oh really? Oh really? <laughs> Play gaming. If you if you notice, he actually spent five hundred minutes at Huttville doing a live stream. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's five hundred. Yeah, he had to do a five hundred minute live stream for five hundred subs. Yeah. Did not. I didn't know that happened. Bananas. Well, you know. <laughs> hey there. You You've been out of our lives. <laughs> uh. It was. But like I said, it was nice. <laughs> yeah, I was beginning to wonder if he still existed. We. I couldn't. I couldn't make it, uh, a figure of my imagination, or if you were actually a real memory. Me? Yes, you. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. He thought you died. No, I thought he was a figure of my imagination. I couldn't know if my memories of you were real. I don't think you guys wouldn't even know. What? Not like you. You never, you never had, we would talk to you, you just don't. You gotta kind of start the conversations here, because I don't really talk to anybody. Hey, so you, you picked yourself out of the chat. Yes, yes, I did. Yeah, yeah, Why yeah, was yeah. That? yeah. Here, like, you guys don't talk to me. It's like you took yourself out of the <laughs> chat, and we had to add you of, back. I was tired of listening to it. We're just talking about the government, I think. Well, that no, well, well, we're, we're gonna conserve those to the uh, to the <laughs> minus ten points for being here, chat. Oh yeah. yeah. Anyways. Bananas and Sprite Challenge uh, dissected. The water bottle commented, wow, lots of experiments. Yes, we. Uh, I was being relatively thorough with testing this one to figure out what was causing the reaction we got. It was good. It was a good video. Did we have bloopers for this one? Uh, I don't no, no, so. we did not. We did not have bloopers. So we don't, well, to be fair, we only really had one tape. True. <laughs> we just, True. The whole thing was just one big take. We couldn't exactly do a second take. Yeah, we didn't have enough bananas and Sprite. Don't be a menace to society. TJF Talks 99. We, so I, would, I was just talking about him on the 500 minute uh, live stream. But Lamar Ooh. David. Oh. Lamar is back in the chat, boys. Is that does that name ring a bell? Yeah, he was like no. Okay, I guess nobody watched the early streams, but Lamar was. Oh, I remember Lamar. Yeah, yeah, they uh, we we all roasted him because he was a simp. I don't remember what he said. Yeah. But anyways, Lamar David commented, whatever happened to all your roommates? Yeah, we had Lamar, we had Mike. Mike and Lamar would, like, freaking fight each other in the chat. It was great. The good old days. Well, anyways, Lamar asked what happened to my roommates. I said, ah, yeah, I graduated and moved out. They also have all gone their own ways. I still talk with them from time to time. You know, I send them memes. Uh, we're actually they finally kicked you out. We're actually going to go visit... Well, I'm going to, potentially. We'll see what happens. <laughs> it may just be me on a lonely drive up to Canada by myself, but... Canada. Well, there's a story here. There's a story. Nobody listens to my story. Story time. 
story time. So Rondo texts me. He's like, I'm moving to North Dakota. And I'm like, what? He's moving to this town that's on the border between North Dakota and Minnesota. It's like an hour and a half from the Canadian border. It's only like seven and a half hours from here. And I'm like, which, which uh, the water bottle was talking to me about this. He's like, I can't believe you can get to, uh, you know, Canada. You know, get to another country in this in less time than it takes to get to certain parts of Wyoming. Which, uh, which uh, it's true. I mean, <laughs> the state. True. Yeah. yeah it took us. We dropped to Evanston. Took us twelve hour, hours. Twelve hours. Yeah. yeah, we we could have dr- driven like deep into Canada by that point. Mm-hmm. It, you know, if we exclude how long it takes to cross the border, which I think I don't, it into, depends how what you mean by deep, because Canada is huge. True, that is true. As I learned when I was looking up, how long does it take to drive from Seattle to? Uh, uh, to Alaska, and uh, you can drive to Seattle quicker than you could drive from Seattle to Alaska. <laughs> it's like a two-day journey from Seattle to Alaska. That's constant driving. It's insane how far it is. But anyways. Well, yeah, does, does Canada have more surface area than the U.S.? Uh, Canada... Uh, if I'm not mistaken, Russia and then Canada are the – Russia is the largest country in the world, followed by Canada, then followed by the United States, then followed by either Brazil or China. Mm. Brazil and China are kind of funky. It really depends on what parts what parts you actually give to China, like Taiwan and stuff. It's yeah. that close um, in size. I wouldn't count. Taiwan or Hong well, Kong as part of China. Well, yeah, I know. Wait, wait. So, I mean, do you believe that they're their own independent nations? Yeah, they've been functioning as independent nations for years, but China has been trying to retake the re- retake them. Yeah, the biggest. Is of uh, the United Nations. Uh, they're not record. They There's don't have 193 a... recognized nations. No, the... because everyone's too scared of China. Mm-hmm. Literally, the U.S. is the only co- like we don't actually even recognize Taiwan. But uh, apart from a few small countries, uh, actually, uh, Tuvalu, I think, Tuvalu. Sorry, oh. Tuvalu just recognized Taiwan. Hmm. Tuvalu and a bunch of other small countries just recognize Taiwan. So they're technically a country if we're talking well, – what? because to be a country, you have to be recognized by three UN member states. Um, I thought it was like half. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, anyway. I don't know. Well, well anyways. So it's – Oh, well, anyways, the big thing with Taiwan now is Nancy Pelosi's planning a, a flight over there. And, oh, yeah, I heard about that. Well, China is like, we're going to shoot down her plane. What? Oh, what? Yeah. Just because what? I guess they want to start World War Three because that will actually start World War Three. Yeah, they shoot down a... They shoot down a U.S. plane. And kill, you mm-hmm. know, the Speaker of the House. This will wait, cause wait. World War Three. Would it have to be in the... Would it matter if it's in their airspace or not? Because if, if they it's shoot in Chinese it down in airspace, internet... then the U.S. can't really say. the US... But if it's in international waters, it's World War Three. Okay, I was going to say, if it's in international waters, that's a declaration of war. But if it's in Chinese airspace, what would that mean? Uh, it's up to the U.S. to decide what they want to do. And considering that... The, they should to make it to the U.S. Embassy in time. And considering that we're the only permanent member state on the uh, U.N. Security Council, I think we get to do what we want. Because I think Russia was the only other one, and I think they voted Russia off the island. So uh, I think that leaves just the U.S. as a permanent member state of the U.S. Security... of the U.N. Security Council. 
。Fun, fun, fun. Mm-hmm. But yeah, uh, so. Not, 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 not good. If the if, if they shoot down the plane, which I mean, if they do, it is World War Three. Uh, it won't be nuclear unless Russia decides to join them. But I don't know why Russia would. It, you know, this is all China's doing. So it won't be nuclear because a China has enough nukes to like. You know, they're gonna get some past the U.S. defenses. But、uh, the U.S. has enough nukes to retaliate that we could probably wipe out ninety-nine percent of their population,、uh, you know, within five hours. So, you know, and then I, I honestly, I, I really do think the U.S. population spread out just enough that China would still have a larger population than the U.S., but the U.S. would still have more infrastructure remaining. Personally, but because that's just because of how dense China is. But I don't know. I don't know.、Uh, on, on to more comments, possibly.、Uh, oh yeah, how much is the majority of the interior? Is it non-arable land? Yeah, I think so. Once you get past a certain point. <laughs> I need a topography map. Oh, here we go. Yeah, once you get past basically this, <laughs> this is all desert and mountains. Once you get past this, and not gonna lie, some of this is even arable thanks to pollution. So. You know, fun times, fun times.、Uh, anyways, going to the movies alone is weird. TJFT ninety nine. Ethan Oakes commented the intro one hundred, so he's saying it's good.、Uh, thank you.、Uh, I mean, we've had it for seventy podcasts now, so you know, it's weird that you're making a comment about now. All right, on to the gaming channel. Which is doing quite well recently, and of course, YouTube Studio has a bug where you can't switch without it crashing. So you know, solid. All right, let's look at the comments here. Uh, two weeks ago. Okay, currently, uh, I have posted a video two weeks ago. It's now the most popular video on this channel at 54 views, considering the most popular view, popular uh video before that was. Thirty views.、Uh, that's a pretty big improvement. Anyways, Pyramid One done. Minecraft One Hundred Five.、Uh, the Water Bell commented, "Only four hundred more episodes to go." I'm、um, like, lol, pretty much.、Uh, Ryan Orange commented, "Next build chocolate chip cookie and、uh, when is a stream?" I don't know when the next stream is, Ryan, and I have other plans. I think I've already read those comments before. Hard to say. I, honestly, honest to God, I can't ever remember. Uh, ch 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 ch. Anybody remember those commercials? No.、Yeah. Just me. Okay. What? <laughs> hey, it's building a mob grinder. Super flat survival number three. The water bottle coming. We did build a mob spawner in our last sky block. Also, the series is keep it. Is great. Keep it going. Yes, I'm very. I really am enjoying the super flat, except for the fact that I need to grind、uh, wandering traders, and that is proving to be more difficult than I could have ever have imagined. But you know, it is what it is. It is what it is.、Uh, moving on from that one, Shh. building a fishing cabin, Minecraft、uh, Bedrock Let's Play thirty eight. The water bottle commented. New style of video is sick. Thank you. I've recently changed the style of the gaming channel videos, and、uh, I, I think they're much better videos than they were before. So, Pyramid Two is complete. Minecraft One Hundred Six. The Waterball commented. I feel like the series progress or progresses much quicker 
with this new style of Let's Play. Also, the pyramid area is shaping up very nicely. Yes. Uh, with the new style, there's a lot... I do a lot more work per episode than I did before. And so, yes, uh, things progress much faster than they were before. Chopping down every tree in my Minecraft world. Minecraft uh, Small World 39. Ooh, I mislabeled this. I'll have to fix that later. Uh... A Midwestern person likes flat land, and it's got a surprised emoji face. I commented, lol. What a surprise, right? Yeah. What? <laughs> what? Yeah, of course a Midwesterner likes flat land, you know? And that is all the comments. Now onto the future of the channel before we move on to the fourth segment. So the future of the podcast. So, we, I, uh... We, we, yeah, is that going to be a normal thing? Well, I, I, uh, do you realize how difficult it was to get this one? We had to, like, beg Kyle to to not work today. Oh, Does he normally work today? Yeah, I don't work Mondays. I just don't want to be here. <laughs> I don't blame you. <laughs> no, uh, you're really cutting into my nap time by having this. Your nap? Time. If you're taking a nap this late in the day, that's called sleep. I take a nap from four o'clock to about seven o'clock. How do you sleep at night? I if I did that, I'd like be up baby. till four a.m. Why am I so pixelated? Sleep pretty well. I am very pixelated right now. Hmm. Also, I had a friend who wanted to do some gaming today too. So you're lucky. I had a cancel on her. Well, her. her. That doesn't weigh yeah. anything on here. He he would that he he'll never ask any of these girls out ever. Period. No. There we go. What more do I need to say? Only person here who ever has a shot with a woman is actually in a relationship with a woman, and is the only person we can actually ever ask for uh, reasonable advice within the group. Well. Yeah. The man's been at this for a year. He, he's a professional compared to us schmucks. Yeah. Well, what, well what is your recommendation to hey, How has she not gotten tired of you? <laughs> what? Wait, quick question. Is she blind or deaf? Uh. He asked, is she blind or deaf? Or possibly paraplegic. <laughs> Jill, shut up. Will, you're, you're breaking up there for a bit. We can't hear you. I said no. No? no okay. Well, she's a normal person. I've met her. She's a very normal person. Normal? She doesn't like me. I'll tell you that much. Mm. That's uh, funny. Well, I don't blame her. Well, I'm an acquired taste, so. Not <laughs> much so. Now, if she met Phil, I don't think I she'd like I have to deal her. with you. Well, well, everybody agrees with that, with the fact that I am an acquired taste. I it's have not on. acquired to it. I don't think I my parents are still. With I, I still don't think my parents ever acquired the taste. No. No. <laughs> Probably not. You're more of an intolerable taste. Yeah, intolerance. Yeah, no, no. My mom kind of gained the taste. What? My mom gained the taste once you moved out. Oh, only once I moved out. Yeah. Oh, but when I was living there, I was just a bum. We still are. Hey, that's for me to that's for me to define myself. <laughs> moved out. That was I moved Wait, hold on. When did she define moved out? Are we talking f sophomore year of college or freshman year of college cuz I haven't lived full time when at you home. Actually, when you actually moved out and uh, weren't just coming here to wash your clothes. Ah, uh, sophomore year of college. Yeah, 
sophomore year. Well, that's because she doesn't have to watch. That's because she wasn't washing my clothes anymore. Mm. Well, I, well, I mean, I, I go home to wash not. my clothes, but I wash them myself. Yeah, you munch off all of our food on Sundays. Well, you don't eat it. He has you there. You don't eat the food to begin with. I, I go home and mom's like, you know, I've got leftovers that are going to go bad. Do you want them? He's not gonna, Kyle's not going to eat them. Yeah. Because I don't nice. eat. Good one. Good one, Phil. <laughs> I mean... God. Man, dog is... <laughs> See, see, there were never, there were never leftovers when I was home. I'm sure they yeah, liked that too. Nope. When I moved out, they're like, "Oh, Dang. we have leftovers." And there wasn't a dirty pizza pan in the freaking like sink tea. every day. I look so. What? Look so. Well, nope, yep, nope. Okay, 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 okay. We still, we still haven't gotten a response, though. What's it like? What has the last year been the happiest year of your life? Me? Yeah, you. you. Yeah. Really? Most productive year of my life. Most productive. productive. How so? You explain. I have a job. I had the best screens that I've had. For a long time. What was that last part? I didn't go to the office. It's the best grades that he's had in a long time. Oh, I didn't get in trouble at school. You get in trouble? Didn't. I didn't. Oh, didn't. Wow. Sounds yeah. like a woman's really improved you. Oh. Yeah. Shocking. Phil, this was... She, this was, she, she Phil. took the world that we knew and loved and turned them into normal. <laughs> yeah, what happened to the weird will? We missed the weird will. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the will that would stick his head out the window and say, Hey, I'm special. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Don't you remember that time we went to the movies? <laughs> You're driving down downtown. You stuck your head out the window and you're like, oh, I'm special. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, what happened to the will where we had to... <laughs> yeah, what happened to the will that we would have to have du duct taped to the back of my seat in my truck <laughs> to keep you oh, yeah. in it? <laughs> and the one where feared for his life the entire damn it or rooster feared for his life the entire time what happened to that will still around oh he's still around what's it take <laughs> to bring him out Adam is dead we don't, we don't want to play with that one <laughs> what the don't say that don't say that don't say that <laughs> don't don't no, you see, see, there's, remember that edge I talked about? Yeah, yeah, you're here, you're here right now. You're above that edge. Bring it back down. <laughs> this is the accepted level. Whether society accepts that level, that's for them to determine. Then there's the level that we don't accept. That's where you are right now. You need to be here. Whether society accepts this area, and maybe it should be here, that's for society to determine, for us to say, screw you. You need to be down here. <laughs> say we want to play with him, that makes you <laughs> up here. Oh. <laughs> that's weird. What? We should go to a movie again, though. Oh, cool. absolutely. What what, 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 kind of movie, what kind of movies are you into these days? Because movies, the only movies we go to see are uh, Marvel. So whatever. Oh. Well, there's another Marvel movie out in November. Oh, yeah, another one three months after that, and after that, and, and then after that, that you know, we'll just start going to all the movies together. It's a quarterly with all thing. Of us. It's a quarterly Do you guys thing. watch Love and Thunder? And we make for use at the end. What'd you say, Kyle? 
Did you guys watch Love and Thunder? Yeah, it's great. I have. I, I liked it. My only problem with the film was the fact that the original cut was four hours long. What? That movie what? is not what you can't make that yeah. movie longer than Endgame. That just kind of so, breaks continuity. So, so it was originally four hours long, and they decided to cut it down to two hours long. So I found the pacing to be very kind of off at times. Is I thought it went too fast. So I wish they kept the original four hour long. But that film. would that would break Endgame though. So. so. Which we've learned is no longer number one because James Cameron's a little bastard. Little what? A little bastard. That's on the four words that we can say. Can we say the female version? Slut. Slut, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is that the female version of bastard and slut? All right, fair enough. Well, that's the no. female version that you accept. There's another female term that starts with a B. Sastard. <laughs> According to my old manager at Menards, it was sastard. Yeah, because he released the film in China to get more uh, money. Money. So it could beat Endgame by like only a hundred million dollars. That's all it took. And I'm just like, what? What a shot. But I don't know if that money was taken to be original inflation or if that was just money taken as today's value and that put him above. What a schmuck. He's an absolute schmuck. James Cameron is a schmuck. And I challenge him. I don't know you why. challenge him. I challenge him. You challenge him. I don't know what I'm challenging him to. Maybe to not be a schmuck? Because <laughs> I'm a schmuck. I'm the king of schmucks. <laughs> and he's challenging my spot for king of schmucks. <laughs> and I don't accept that. I'm the biggest schmuck around, and I don't accept him impeding him. Absolutely. My that is true. I don't appreciate that. You don't see, he's a menace to society. He fits in that thumbnail for the po last time's podcast. He's a menace. I don't know how this has to do anything with the future of the channel. Uh, uh, mosh pit fight? With... What, what, what year are you in school? He's going to be a junior. A junior? Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. you ready to take her to the prom? Have you have a, a proposal sign set up yet? Are you, you going to think that through? Yeah. Well, I mean, not yet. I mean, yeah, you got like at least. That's like days. spring. But you're you still although your uh, homecoming sign, you've got like two weeks to work on that thing. Two weeks. I have a little work on that. Well, that you better thing? start working because it Did is expected that? that the people in relationships make their homecoming proposal signs like, especially once we're in senior high now. We're talking like that first, second week of school there. Why? Why? I don't know. It's social convention. Like I said, and yeah, good society. Question. Why? I don't. What, I, if I, you don't I, what if he doesn't want to go? I don't know. Well, then society will shun him. Listen, we, this group here exists All outside right. of society, okay? We are our own society here, okay? It's an imperfect society since we're all a bunch of white guys, but a, uh, but a society nonetheless. We do exist outside of society. We have to abide by the other societal rules because if we didn't, well, you know, we're, we're, I'm already the king of schmucks. Well, uh, no, so sorry, the second king of schmucks. Uh, James Cameron's the biggest schmuck now. Mm -hmm. That is, that is uh, quantifiable now. Mm -hmm. Every one hundred, every dollar he earned above Endgame because he's a petty little slut uh, makes him a schmuck. Mm -hmm. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, it's like you have enough money, bro. I don't. We don't. No one here has enough money. 